check, check. Oh, Siri bot. You lying little minx. What am I going to do with you? Anyway. Welcome back, folks. Welcome back to twitch.tv slash tripperberry, and welcome back to some more Chinese parents in the Lunar New Year Showcase. When last we left off, we were just about to finish middle school, and then going to move into high school and face the Gao Cow, the, the, the life-defining test in college entrance exam that comes at the end of high school. So, without further ado, let's load things up. There we are. Yeah, we are Snatamwick. There we are. Okay. Yeah, we're fairly well rounded, except for, you know, we're, yeah, we're not the most athletic, but we're close enough. Okay, we have new requests in. Let's have a look at that. Oh, yeah. We did just get the commemorative album, so that's fine. And we're, we're saving up requests for a very particular reason. You'll see why in about 10 turns or so. Right, we're just... Honestly, we're, I'm going to ignore that. Uh, Study-wise, we're about... You're about 60% of the way through on the main ones, and then... Excuse me. About halfway on liberal arts and science. Now, things are only going to get more expensive from here. In terms of, like, the cost to buy the these skills. So what I'm thinking, and since we are going hard on the... Uh, on the the uh, the manga creator route, we may de-emphasize uh, the main stuff and then lean heavy on our the imagination tech and then or the imagination stats and then we basically try to prepare ourselves for a future in the lucrative world of manga creation. Because what could possibly go wrong there? <laughs> All right, anyway, let's get to it. So we are, okay, at ease, everything is perfectly normal. Perfectly normal, I say. All right. I will take that, then we'll go. So if we're going to do that, if we're going to pivot from, there we go, if we're going to pivot and then go hard on your future skills, we may want to de-emphasize picking up these, uh, the, ta the, uh, the, the talent fragments that increase our per turn, and instead, you know, look hard into just hoovering up as much knowledge as possible. Now, I'm not 100% sure if, you know, uh, basically, like, it, do we have enough time left, or is it, oh, there we go, nice. Yeah, we, we might have pivoted a little too late, I guess, to, like, to get the, like, the maximum, the maximum return, but I think we should, we should, there should be enough time for us to at least secure a decent paying, decent enough paying job for ourselves and for our, uh, in our future progeny. So let's see. Uh, hmm. We got 44. I'll tell you, if you want to hedge against getting sick, maybe we'll do that. We'll take one of those. Now we can't click any more of these, but what we can do, we can take that nine energy and do a little more work. In this case, uh, probably groceries. Because 
because we're at the point where you know buying you know, we're still at the point where you know, uh buying stress relief items is it's going to be a fairly regular thing for us even though it is it really is starting to uh cut into our reserves Yeah, and we're kind of friendless at this point, but I don't, I don't, I'm not that bothered. As it remind myself, uh, how, how deep, okay, yeah, oh, we're only like two out of nine into the, into this. Yeah, we're, we need to get moving. Oh. Okay, so if we, if we keep 20 action behind, we can become a manga assistant. And, you know, even at the low end, that's going to be some darn good money. Alright, so there's that, and then how... Let's see, how do we keep our uh, how do we keep our stress as low as possible while still not you know cratering our parental approval? Odd as it sounds, it looks like Children's Palace is still the way to go. Yeah, that's actually not bad, and we'll get like little buffs in the in the other ones as well from. Uh, from what? From manga? Yeah, from manga basics. It actually gets this EQ and memory as well. So that's actually a pretty nice combination right there. Okay. You begin watching eSports, and Sky soon becomes your idol. I have no idea who that is. I, uh, you even buy eSports magazines. Okay, well, everyone needs a hobby. Alright, so we got a so we, we, we have acquired moderate stress, and somehow that earns us money. Okay. Like, uh, <laughs> I like our progression and learning and the, learning the basics of manga there. Tea party. Everyone is supposed to give shows, but your parents have let you anything but study. Okay. I imagine that that's a school event that uh, uh, apparently went poorly for us. Yeah, okay, we got Humanity Be Gone, which is apparently is something we learned from doing manga. Massive disconnects. The guys are all playing an online game, but the servers are crappy and they keep disconnecting. No, never experienced that before. Mm -mm. Okay. Yeah, those are all still fabulously expensive, unfortunately. Actually, manga coloring was cheaper than when we bought it with uh, than we bought the previous tech. Strange. Anyway, so next time around, well, let's let's uh, you know, let's leave twenty energy right at the end, and then we'll see what kind of work that gets for us. Okay. All right, so we have you have the uh, you have the king of hiatus. You have mastered the basics of character structuring. Next up, we'll begin a special training when it comes to drawing manga. Speaking of which... That's it. Hold on. Yes, what is it? Uh, when you're going to return... Can you... Retina x Retina. My hair is growing gray from all the waiting. Hmm, I wonder what that could be in, re in reference to. And I'll, there's a question again. I've finished drawing and the story is all mostly done. So if anything unexpected happens, it should be out soon. <laughs> Kaya Kaisika 46. The best. As I suspected, you've been spending all your time following idol girl, idol girl groups instead of drawing, haven't you? I'm just taking a hiatus, okay? <laughs> anyway, let's get down to business. Listen now. Draw me three different manga drafts per week. And as for the drawing method... Okay. I think our... Our manga mentor has been found out, and we have an, okay, we have another show. Oh, nice! Humanity Begone is rare. 
Here, reading my manga works enables you to rid yourself of filthy ambitions. <laughs> uh, what have we done? We've done Pinion Spelling Bee, we've done Piano Beast, and we got a couple runner-ups. Uh, Album Lover, I guess? I, I am completely baffled by what works here. Okay, yeah. A song no one can sing. That's, uh... Seems self-defeating, but alright. Okay. And... Woohoo! Apparently, uh, liking elementary school photo albums is... popular? So two... Oh, wow! 250 knowledge and a hundred face. That is that is huge. No idea why it worked the way it did, but boy am I glad it did. Alright, moving on. Okay, yeah. I think by this point... We are mostly knowledge-focused. Although... Yeah, this, now, this is now... Ima oh, right, it's imagination and memory, so that's... And we have... Uh, both of those are pretty decent stats, so maybe that's why it's so cheap. Okay, nice that they're showing us that, straight off the bat. this run through the map. So how do we want to use this? We do have a purple shiny. The purple that would get us a whole bunch of imagination. Let's see, what what kind of effect would that have? So if we pop the purple shiny and get us all the purple nodes in there, it would take it from 272 to 266. Okay, not much of an effect. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I just remember. Yeah, we, we want... We want to save 20 action points so that we can go work as a manga assistant. So, we'll take one of those. Yeah, we seem to be rather lacking in drive here, but that's mostly fine. Oh, it's definitely fine. We basically doubled our money from one session as a monk assistant. <laughs> hey, Mountain Ash Street, good to see you. Knife technique, you say? Yeah, it's a. Yeah, that is the start of the uh, the cooking uh, skill tree. That is a uh, that can lead you to be either I think if I remember correctly, you either be a a state ba a state banquet chef or a Michelin star chef, if you get all the way to the top. Not a suggestion, just a reflection or just a reaction. Okay. <laughs> oh, it is where it says it says knife technique, but it has, you know, a, a photo of you know chopsticks and noodles. <laughs> but you know what? Now that we're filthy rich off a of one day at work, let's go spend. There we go. Uh, let's see. Do we need do we need fifty satisfaction? I don't think that we do. Yeah, 
Yeah, actually, we can go on Mountain Ash Tree. Everything nice and quiet out here. I got a, I got a nice big pot of curry going over in the other room. You know what? Is it, where is he? How far along are we in this? Yeah, we're only three, three out of nine in the, in there. So, uh, yeah, I'll go ahead and do that. Uh, well, can I, uh, 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 play a vegetable curry? We got peas, carrots, snow peas, green beans. Um, what else did I put in there? Oh, yeah, and broccoli. And then you have the usual spices and sauces. Um, Yeah, that's about it. It's it's pretty simple. I just I just look for uh, recipes where I can just throw everything in a pot and ignore it for several hours. And as it turns out, slow cookers are tailor made for people like me. Okay, so we go from EQ, imagination, and memory to just imagination and memory. No, no further buffs to EQ. Well, darn. Oh, we have we have social media, or stay at home. So, uh, apparently, stay at home is an entertainment now. Okay. Little dubious as to the usefulness of that. And also, Ding's satisfaction. Is there anything that increases satisfaction? Uh, there is. Child Care Center. Now, how, how does that work? Oh, well. Oh, well. We'll go with this. You know, we could use a little buff to IQ and imagination, and at the very least, this doesn't decrease satisfaction. So, as far as entertainment goes, probably the best we can hope for. across a group of unemployed youths after school and the class the class gangsters help you out wow okay the class gangsters are on our side so uh i guess it's good to know bad people I don't know. okay you find your interest for some class waning after you have changed teachers oh okay they said you could bring computers to class but then they changed the rules. Oh, oh no! New requests? Okay, let's see what we have. We have... We have art movies. Art movies should be watched at home. I don't, I don't know about that. We have luxury snacks. <laughs> or the new phone. Honestly, I think art movies would probably work the... Work the you got taste. Gee, thanks, Dad. Ah, <laughs> uh, yes. Let's see. Why am I learning coloring? Isn't manga just black and white? Besides, I think the black and white ones are much better than the ones with color. Many believe that is the case because when you're drawing with black and white, you have to rely on skill alone to break out the details, whereas it is simply it is simpler to display them in color. But it is still a technique you need to master. You can't give up just because it is difficult. Say, if the editorial department want to publish your manga on the colored pages, but you do not have the skill to do so, you'll lose a great opportunity for nothing! That does indeed make sense. I'll follow up your guidance. Okay, here are a few sketches of mine. Try coloring them, and I'll give you some suggestions once you're done. Hey, oh, it's your horses! Isn't this a draft for your cereal? <laughs> These are just some scratch drafts. There's no need to be nervous. Once you've improved in skill, you can work as my assistant. And an almost... That way I can go play Mahjong to my heart's content. <laughs> I heard that. <laughs> I think we're being taken for a ride, friends. I think our mentor is getting some free labor out of us. What do we got? Uh, we are happy. Absorbing fragments has an as a chance to grant an extra two action. Nice. Oh dear. 
this got very expensive all of a sudden. Okay, uh, yeah, maybe we'll have to lay off on that for just a bit. Yikes. Okay, not bad. Also, what does that take? Is that, you know, it's, it's imagination and memory, so maybe... If we can uh, start racking up some uh, memory points, too, maybe that, that would uh, help in our quest. Uh, so you got lots of red, lots of purple. Okay, we'll definitely take the lots of purple. Uh, okay. I don't know, that feels like a lot of EQ just to pass up. Alright, we got the energy, let's do it. Okay, because what I'm... Yeah, we're going to need a whole big chunk more of knowledge if we're going to, like, you know, stay current on, like, the main the main Galkao subjects. So much so that it makes me question whether it's even worth the effort. Okay, and then once once more into the breach. You know, we're out there getting some real world experience. You know, getting getting exploited by uh, real world employers while we're still in school. But man, that money that is real good money. Hey, Waffle Iron, welcome in. Good to see you. Hope you are having a fantastic weekend. We will, of course, de-stress. And you know what? We keep we keep getting dinged on uh, parental approval. So, well, I mean, do we want to do that? Because that is kind of the nuclear option. Yeah, it's not like it's bad, it's just, like, not not high. I bet... Yeah, not bad out here. You know, pretty quiet. Got some curry going in the other room, in the slow cooker. Had some nice pancakes for, for a, a late lunch. And, uh, yeah. And just, just kind of, uh, trying to get, get back... In, you know, get back into the, uh, the routine, now that, uh... Now that holiday January is back, and uh, and then we're into like actual January pancakes. Oh no, not not like breakfast pancakes, but like savory pancakes. Uh, the kind the kind that made with eggs. Like they're, they're not strictly. They're like uh, yeah, they're they're probably closer to crepes than pancakes. But they but they get called pancakes here for whatever reason. Yeah, these what they. Like, they're like two layers of them, and then they put like uh, they put crispy wontons and vegetables. And this this one had uh, char siu, uh, barbecue pork, and Peking duck in the middle as well. So it's really good. Yeah, it is. It it is. It is really. It is. Uh, I uh, I found this. Found the place on. Uh, Actually, I think I found it when I first moved here. Because um, when I first moved to Hong Kong, it was still when they were doing two weeks of hotel quarantine, so you couldn't... You, you were basically stuck in the hotel room for two weeks. Um, so that, that obviously that necessitated a lot of delivery. So... 
so what I en what I ended up doing was I mean, just uh, just basically combing through like the 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 local delivery uh, equivalents of you know DoorDash and whatnot. And one of the things that got, got recommended just because it was nearby was uh, it just basically it was uh, like a, they, they called themselves a snack shop, but they sold like they sold pancakes. Now, the pancakes that sounds weird, but but actually. I had to, you know, use Google Translate because the, uh, <laughs> that the menu wasn't in English, but I was able to work out that they're like savory pancakes, and they were nearby, and they weren't very, they weren't very expensive, so I had to deliver one day, and then I, I was just hooked from there on out. Because it, it was, like, you know, if, if fast, it, it was a rare combination of fast, cheap, and good. And, it, and if you ever run into something like that in the wild, I mean, cling to it like, uh, you know, cling to it like grim death because it's uh, it's something to be something to be savored. Let's see. What? Okay, we just got art movies, which would absolutely supercharge our EQ, but uh, also. <laughs> Also, crater our parental satisfaction. So how about this? We do. We, let's do one more round of reading comprehension, and then two art movies. So we'll get a little stress, but otherwise it'll be fine. That's beyond blue moon levels of break. Yeah, it's. And then, like, I think it was last year, I I panicked when I went to the little delivery site, and they weren't on there anymore. And they didn't have their own website. That's how small of a shop it is. But uh, fortunately, as it as it just turned out, they switched delivery services. And I guess you can't do both. So they they switched sides in, in the great civil war of, you know, delivery. <laughs> but yeah, it's... And actually, somehow, the prices got cheaper in between. So we just we just go from strength to strength here. Also, Satan, welcome in. You can't disappoint your parents if you run away and become a vampire. Well, uh, I guess it depends on your parents' expectations for you, then, doesn't it, Satan? There used to be a hot dog truck near your childhood hometown that had the best dirty water hot dogs for 45 cents each. Nice. Well, now, now we have to, we have to know, Waffle Iron. What did you put on said hot dogs? You don't know when it started, but the boys and girls begin comparing themselves to each other. Well, I think you can pretty well tell, tell where it started. You put cheese on it? You know what? I salute your choices, Waffle Iron. <laughs> you can't enter Examination Hall 1 because you aren't among the top 20 in your class. Oh, no! It's just destroying our stress even more. You were eight. You couldn't appreciate the finer aspects of chili, relish, or onion. I mean, okay, but I mean, it's cheese is a is a perfectly fine topic for a hot dog. Bonus points if you turn your mom into a vampire too, uh, but it's hard to tell these. Um, <laughs> I think yeah, message got cut off there, Satan. Uh, okay, where were we? Ah, yes. Is this any cheaper? Um, a little cheaper. Not by much. Oh. Oh, but it's the 16th, 17th century. Okay, yeah. Yeah, if that's the case, you probably got a little more leeway. Okay, so now we have another midterm exam, which is just like the little match three game going on here. There we go. Yeah, so the whole idea is we, we just need to like make these little combinations. As so we need like this one we need a two. A one and a one. See, you get the twos by combining those. You combine getting three ones and you get a two. Then you combine three twos and you get a three.
causing a lot of chaos, and then end up moving your human dad in with you and your new vampire boyfriend, and... This is a very specific scenario you're detailing here, Satan. You had, uh... You don't have anything particular in mind, do you? Lestat de Leoncourt? Aha, I see. Okay, um... Yeah, these aren't okay, these aren't exactly are in our favor. Let's go ahead refresh the questions. And that's not much better. Okay. That's a little more manageable. Oh, you watched Queen of the Damned last night. Oh, okay. And then if you knew how it was changed from the books. Oh, um... Right, yeah, that was one of the... That was the... That was, was That was Anne Rice's follow-up to Interview with the Vampire, I think. Is that right? No, we want that. And we want those. Yeah, there we go. Okay, yeah, we need more yellow on the board, so let's see what we can do about that. Nice. Uh, Queen of the Damned adapts the next two... Oh, Vampire Lestat and Queen of the Damned. Okay, so it's kind of a... Uh, so it's a mashup. I gotcha. Just about out of place, but we've actually we've racked up a. Uh, I say we actually we haven't quite doubled, but we like we like increased our uh, knowledge pool by like fifty percent. So that's I mean, you know, given given what we were looking at, it's actually not that bad. Yeah, we're, yeah we're, we're not working this turn, but that's fine. Okay, that's good. It's not a good adaptation. Okay. What, uh... What kind of changes did they make that would, that would, that made it worse? Um... I only know the Anne rice verse mostly through reputation. And having seen the, uh, having seen the interview with the vampire, so... I'm all ears. Uh, but yeah, I, I have... I have nothing to add as an observer. Oh, right, yeah, we need to... Oh, okay, shop refresh. What have we got? A karaoke voucher. Uh, we got discount film tickets. Ooh, hey, we got disco tickets. Yeah! That's what the modern youth of China like to do. Disco. <laughs> oh, we got uh, parental satisfaction nights, too. Well, we're definitely doing those. Uh, they barely adapt either book and heavily stray wash it. Oh, okay. Well, I guess I can kind of see that if, if it was... Because um, what were those, like, late 90s, early 2000s? If that's the case, yeah, I can, I can definitely see why they, uh, 
they probably came under a lot of pressure to straight wash it. Because even, you know, 2002 was in the Falcon. Okay, yeah, that does make sense. It was, uh... <laughs> you know, it was only like 20 years ago, but it's, uh... You know, LGBT, uh... Representation didn't... It was... It, was, it wasn't... What it was, what it, what it is now, it definitely was not what it was in Hollywood then. You know, even Hollywood's reputation for being the uh, you know the the cesspit of liberalism that it is in some quarters. Yeah, you know, even then, you know, movies got to make money, and the money men in Hollywood are convinced that the the gay would squick out people in Peoria or or whatever. It very limits Lestat's character as his traits are gay, French, and and a whore. Okay. Well, I mean, yes. Yeah, it, yeah, it, yeah. I would imagine, it, just knowing what I know about Lestat's character from Interview with the Vampire, uh, if you actually tried to put him on screen, it would it would uh, it might not play well in certain quarters, and not just with the Dove Foundation. I just, I'm, I'm looking at where we are. We're only... We got 12 turns to go until the Gal Cow, and we're like 60% of the way through like the, the main... the main skill trees. And while on one hand that worries me, on the other hand... It kind of doesn't. You know, screw it. No, we're... Louis doesn't even appear to get a mention. Oh, okay. Yeah, that is a pretty pretty big oversight. You know what? Screw it. I say... Yeah, we're, we're, we're going full Weasley. Our future lies outside of Academe. So, we're, we're going hard. On our, on our professional training. You know, even though we massively overpaid for it. Okay, and then see, no, we don't want to do art movies because that's gonna that's gonna ding our satisfaction, which is kind of low already. Oh, no, not, well, no, actually, actually, memory might not be such a bad idea after all. Yeah, that'll, that'll, that'll work. We'll do that. Oh, time for senior high school. Oh, no, here we go. I mean, senior high school, I've worked hard for it. And I really hope it's better than my junior high school. And suddenly the music takes a dramatic turn. The interesting thing. Some say it's a preparation for Gal Cow. It's as if your parents only care about your grades. Well, it's because they do. You know, the best student class always says she has a study for the exam. Yes, score is the best. Yeah, and, uh, and no one believes her. And you can't sleep well because you're worrying about tomorrow's exam. Here at high school freshman, don't fiddle around. If you don't lay a solid foundation for future learning now, you'll never be able to enter a key university. Okay, we got a got an exam coming up. Okay, and again, that is that is as a. Uh, Yeah, unfortunately, text can't get more expensive than 999. 
So, I guess we have that going for us. All right, first things first, we'll check in with the, the King of Hiatus. Do you mean you say you want to learn about anime? It pains me that you, you do not wish to be my assistant. Eh, that's not what I meant. I just, I just want to learn different ways to improve my art. I know of a few skills, but I am by no means an expert, and I can't go about misleading my apprentice. Let me take you someplace. I'll introduce you to a master. But whether he'll teach you or not, that depends on you. Several moments later. Let me introduce you. This is the master of anime, Mayao Hiyazaki. Hiyazaki, this is my apprentice. Hello, it's Hiyazaki. I am the king of Hiatus' apprentice. I want to learn about anime. Ah, I recognize the spark in your eyes. You will work hard to better your skills for sure. All right, I accept you as my apprentice. Wow, thank you so much, Mr. Hiyazaki. Okay, I'll leave you in Hiyazaki's capable hands. The rest is up to you. He seems nice. I'm sure he's not curmudgeonly at all. Perfect Chinese accent. Thank, thank you, Waffle Iron. I appreciate that. I I have worked hard to uh, to get hone my my voice acting skills for this very uh, this this very game. Okay, so we do. Okay, we're gonna do this first. Yeah, so absorbing knowledge fragments gains us an extra five knowledge. We're a big fan of that. So much so, we're just gonna grab as many of these as we can. Assuming they show themselves, that is. Almost indiscernible from Jean-Claude Van Damme's? Well, it's, it's it. JC is an established actor with many well-beloved titles to his name, so I thank you, Waffle Iron, for your very favorable comparison to that master thespian, Jean-Claude Van Damme. Dude is a rock star. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He, he, honestly, it's uh, I mean, if there's anyone who is has has made a career of made a career out of being in on the joke, it's probably him. Do you see his commercial with the semi trucks? Um. Oh yeah, I think I th I think I know the one you're talking about. But yeah, he, he's had he's had a handful of commercials come out within the last few years. Um, again, kind of leaning into things. I think when that he had the what was it the uh, JCVD film that came out not too long ago. I think that might, that might have uh, kinda, uh, ticked him back up in the public consciousness. Don't even remember what it was for. I just remember he did a split between two semi trucks. Yeah. And honestly, I guess that is. Well, I guess no. I guess that's the the exact opposite of what you want a commercial to be. The commercial you're supposed to remember the product, but then you, if you remember everything but the product, it basically had the the opposite of the intended effect. Okay, so we get sixes across there. We got five out of nine there, and we have 11 turns to go. So we could actually finish out at least one of these. I, I hate it. I hate it, but I'm going to do it. Yeah, those are just going to leave. Because I still want to have enough points left over to... You know, still keep working down the professional tree. Alright, so now... Now we do the... Uh, 
we do the exam, we find out just how far behind the curve we are. Okay, uh, well, I turns out the parents are not upset with us getting a B for the first time. Uh, so, you know, science and arts, we are, we're on pace, so we don't need to worry about that. We are behind the curve on the other three. Apparently getting a C is just completely unthinkable. There we got that, and that, and that, but we're not going to worry about any of that. We're still going to lean hard on imagination, if for no other reason than, like, there's, you know, it's... There aren't a lot of things that just increase imagination all on its own, so that's going to be... It's going to be important for us to keep up with that. And the game suggests we stay at home. I don't know about that. I think it's a... Uh... No, we're going we're gonna to do one more of those, and then we're going to do... We'll do some art movies. But before we do that, we're going to head back to the shop. There we go. So it'll cost us some satisfaction, but you know, this will min we'll mitigate the stress gain. And it'll get us a whole big chunk of uh, EQ as well, which we could possibly use. Okay. There we go. Since attending senior high school, your dad's expectations for you just keep on increasing. Well, gee, thanks. From now on, there will be a placement test every month to check everyone's study progress. Ugh. And, uh, <laughs> yeah, the game is really driving home just how stressful things get when you do when you uh, get to senior high. Between the parental expectations and the school's expectations, in senior high, grades seem to be the only thing that counts. <laughs> that does seem that does seem to be the uh, the theme that's coming through. Stop playing, it's soon time for Gao Cow. You've worked hard over 10 years just for this opportunity of fair competition. Yeah, I questioned how fair it really is, though. When I was your age, I didn't prepare myself well enough for Gao Cow, and look at where that led me. You shouldn't repeat my past mistakes. There you go. Yeah, no, no one can really master Gao Cow, the final exam of the game. Well, okay. <laughs> thanks for that vote of confidence, game. Okay, and yeah, these are all entirely too expensive, so there's not a whole lot we can do about it. Oh yeah, uh, let me show off one other thing real quick. Um, you know, in addition to all this, you can ha you can also actually you don't have to be a complete study head. You can actually have friendships and go date people and whatnot. Um, we've been I've been you know steering clear of that so far, but it's it is a thing you can do. Now, as it happens, doing so as a boy is much harder than it is as a girl. For, you know, for, I guess, for, uh, for game design reasons, for, for, I guess, to real, for realism, you know, partly to simulate, I guess, like, the, the heavy disapproval of, like, you know, students having romantic relationships when they should be studying. But also the experience of, I don't know, there's being some, uh, you know, a disbalance between men and women, but you're just so basically, if you if you do want to, you know, go out with someone, what you do is you hit the friends tab, and then you have to click the contact button. Yeah, we'll we'll pick her. 
Okay, well, she doesn't want to talk to us. So instead, we'll go with we'll go with Phoebe here. Well, you just finish your homework. So we can talk. So then you have a you have a three potential dialogue options, um, and then each end of each uh, romance target has their own preferences, what they value, what they don't like, and then basically you the better answer you give, the more relationship boost, and then. Uh, the the uh, and that the basically the the level of your uh, the, the the number that, uh, of your relationship at the end of the gal cow uh, you can pick that one and basically you have that percent chance of them becoming your spouse so let's see so Phoebe here is a nerd I don't say that disparagingly it's just that she it's a that is her character archetype so she probably would like to talk about the newest school books. I tell you, this set of extra study books will definitely increase, help you increase your grade to 120 points. Anyway, it's really rare meeting someone interesting. Okay, we got a friendship boost with uh, with Phoebe there. There you go. So now it gave us six whole points, six points on a scale of, of zero to 100. So <laughs> you can see how much heavy lifting there is, and then doing that costs you 20 action points, you know, per turn. And you can do it multiple times per turn, but I had to <laughs> I question the the wisdom of doing so. All right, so the uh, the search for knowledge continues. Okay, very nice. Alright. Okay, let's do that. Let's see, yeah, so okay, so now we're back to being happy. Which in your in your experience that is exactly like dating? Yeah, it's uh, a lot of energy expended for a debatable amount of return and uh, you know almost guaranteed disappointment at the end so thanks for that game <laughs> okay, well, go ahead we'll try to stay ahead of the curve on the uh, on Constitution just just to be on the safe side because it, it is lacking compared to all the other stuff we're doing And yeah, we're happy, so Absorbing Fragments has a chance to grant an extra two action, but only a chance, so let's not lean on that. Okay. So that's the end of this particular section. So I guess the question here is... Yeah, you know what? Let's do... Let's... let's uh, Yeah, we'll save a little bit of energy so we can go work and then uh, top up our savings because it, it, it is getting a little low. All right, no, no, we don't. Okay, is that okay? Yeah, that's still 999. One more round of work. Not bad. Not bad. Ooh. 200. Okay, there is a... 
Actually, we still have seven points left over. We could also, like, go buy groceries. We might as well. Because you can't, you can't uh, do anything else with that little remainder of energy. And I don't think it carries over between turns. So, oh, gee, so we got a whole eight. <laughs> okay. So, not a great return, unfortunately. Oh, I guess we could we could buy like some entertainment. Oh, a, ta a tattoo sticker. Okay, I say they probably frown on tattoos. Let's see. You have been on a date for more than one. You could think relationships without a priority. Hey, and that's perfectly fine. So you guys, know, you know, dating is a big thing for some folks and not a big thing for others. It's uh. wider society would have us believe that you're, you know, you're, you are somehow broken or lesser than if you're not out there trying to find the one, but, yeah, really, some folks are just fine, you know, on their own, or just, you know, having a close circle of friends, or, you know, whatever kind of support, uh, uh support structure works for them. You know, cer they're certainly not lesser than for doing so. Actually, no, hang on. Let's... We're trying to buy down this, so we need imagination and memory. So that gets us 25 and 20. That gets us 20 plus satisfaction. Or we could go for more memory. Maybe we go for more memory. So that'll get us parental satisfaction, and then... There we go, and then, you know, do Children's Palace again, we get a little bit more imagination, and it will at least be satisfaction neutral. Oh, okay. It feels as if military training is just for show, and it wasn't as hard as you thought. Well, yeah, that actually makes sense. Look at while the other kids behave. Why aren't you, like, what? What the hell is that? So first we're being disapproved of, then we're being approved of. What? what? That's a strange turn there. Some students say diligence makes up for a lack of talent and begin studying like crazy. Um, yeah, no. Very much not the case. You are not taking the examination seriously. The students of Hong Shui High School get up at five every morning and spend at least two more hours than you do studying. Even a single mark can make a huge difference to your grade. Alright, Teach needs to back it down there. Okay, we have another choice. Let's see. You're getting irritated and you cannot focus in class. You tell your parents it's because of the following issue. Your body, your mood, or you're stressed out. Well, obviously we're stressed out. Your parents feel you are pretentious. Children have anything to stress about. Uh, that, that is empirically untrue. Wish you could say the same, kind of in the same boat, but you're getting up there and, and your mom is pretty eager to be a grandma. Yeah. I mean, there's really not much... Yeah, yeah there's not much you can do about that. And they're... You, know, you, you got... You're your own person, and you can't... Yeah, it's... You can understand their disappointment, but at the same time, you know, it's... You know, they raised you to be you. They didn't raise you to just be a baby factory, hopefully. Yeah, 
Now your mom's not too fussed about having grandchildren. Yeah, I think... I don't know 100% about it, but it feels in our family like that basically my sister is getting all the all the pressure on that front, which sucks, and you know, we, we back her up as best we can, but, you know, but, you know parent's going to parent. Okay. Concept of journey... Uh, yeah, in the, the writing contest, I have absolutely no clue what is, uh, what's going on here. So, yes, for, yeah, for me, this is basically a, uh, a, uh, bubble-clicking exercise. Uh, okay, we got, uh, oh, we got, we have more pips than previously. I don't know how good this is going to be. And we got another Constellation Prize. All right, you know, free knowledge isn't bad. You could have your life together by now instead of being an unemployed student crunching out right into the cake. You know what? You are where you are, Waffle Iron. I wouldn't... You know, if, if you don't have a gig... And you're you're just grinding out rent. Yeah, you're you're in no. I mean, this is gonna sound judgy, but it's and it's not. But it it just makes sense that you know, starting a family would be low on your list of priorities because that you have other things to take care of first. And you don't have to be an absolutely 100% rock solid working order and have everything on lockdown before you start that. But you you kind of do need to have the basics. So yeah, it's. That's not a question of misplaced priorities. That's just that's just being, like, just having like, you know, a sound logic and understanding of where you are. Yeah, it's just not the same when your parents had you. Yeah, though, you know, the the world is very different from whatever it is. You know, 25, 30, 40 years ago, whatever. You remember using the same paper in Japanese class? See? Yeah, me too as well. The, the composition paper. My, uh, it, it, it always seemed too small for me, but that's like my, uh, my, uh, finesse when it came to the, to the, the stroke work was not what it should have been, according to my teachers, but you know what? I just, I got the grades I needed to get, and that was good enough, as far as I'm concerned. It's like, you're not super stressed about it? You don't think your parents totally grasp the difference? In, well, yeah, I, I can definitely understand it feeling bad, Waffle Iron. It's, uh, you, know, you want your parents to understand where you're coming from. But, I mean, it's, that's a them problem. That's not a you problem, though, is it? If they can't wrap their the bacon of their brains around, you know, what it is you're going through and, and why it's, not the same as what they did, then you know that, that's that's their damage. You know, to to steal a phrase. And if they want to give you grief about that, then it's you have every right to you know, to put a stop to that. You know, you know, they owe you the respect of honoring your choices. Oh, sure, yeah, they, they don't, yeah, you didn't say that they do, but I was like, it's, at the very least, you have earned, you know, you've earned the, they should be able to respect your life choices, even if they don't necessarily, if, if it's not what they would have wanted. But no, I, I, I get that, you know, it's not, you're not necessarily pinning that I'm uh, on them, but I say it's it it is it is respect that you are due, regardless. 
Because it's kind of the product of the 80s and those expectations. Mm, okay. Yeah, the, <laughs> the 80s messed a lot of people up. And gave, gave, a, uh, gave folks a, a view of the world that you know, doesn't, doesn't exactly correspond to the way things actually are. N and not just economists. <laughs> okay. So we're back on that knowledge grind, trying to top things up. We have yeah, we have nine turns to go. And if I'm honest, it's probably unlikely that we'll see out everything we would normally want to, but that's that's okay. As long as as long as we can you know get our focuses in, our foci, if you prefer. The nineties weren't much better. Yeah, the the ninety, you know, the, the the fall of the Soviet Union, the end of the Cold War, like the, you know, the nineties, like the the end of history, era. And that that also probably led a lot of folks to make assumptions about the world that it was. Uh, it turned out to be not necessarily the case, because that that was the, yeah, the the the, the yeah the from like was it late 1989. Through, and even through like the, the the mid to late 2000s of the, the unipolar era, when the U.S. basically had the run of the joint, for better or worse, probably was the strongest economy. Yeah, it was absolutely the strongest economy in the world, and it set all these expectations that you know, the 2000s weren't ready for. Yeah, and and then 9/11 happened, and then basically the entire country had a case of temporary insanity. And it, you know, it created a bill we're still paying today. Let's see, we got one, two, three, four, five. Yeah, f you know, five imagination nodes for 20. I don't, I don't know that's a good return. Yeah, let's let's keep on with the working, because you know, we are spending very heavily on stress release, or st 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 stress relief. Yep, yep, close enough. Okay, only 116 this time, but still, you know, a lot better than we make, you know, getting groceries or whatever. 9/11 set up a lot of economic trends, and yeah, and, and to be fair, like it, it also exacerbated a lot, a lot of the other ones. The you know the the push for deregulation, deregulating deregulating like housing and the the you know, finance. Or was it the you know, McCain fine gold and like all well, the the deregulation in the industry that led to the subprime housing crisis and the the subprime mortgages and the mortgage-backed securities. Yeah, it's a uh, it's a lot. Okay, we went to the shop, right? Yeah, we did. Okay. Hey, Packer. Good to see you. How you doing? Hope your weekend is going well. We are we are very nearing. We are we have just entered high school, and then the big life-changing college entrance exam is but nine turns away. And unfortunately, everything is very expensive. Hey, we got seven, 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 and ten, and ten. You're doing good. Glad to hear it. Oh boy. All right, yeah, we'll just. Yeah, I mean, yeah, we've. It's uh. Yeah, we're 16. We just got into high school, uh, and basically every turn has been nothing but you know, people 
sitting on us and demanding we be ready for college already. It's, uh, it's a lot. The player doesn't have undiagnosed ADHD. Uh, the game does not get that... It doesn't get that realistic, Satan, but... We don't have any evidence that's not the case. Yeah, I don't think so. Uh, let's not learn the piano at this point. Yeah, we're looking for... We want memory? Or, or imagination? Uh, okay. So we have 20 stress to burn off. Alright. We're going to learn how to make anime, and then we're going to... Uh, we're going to go to the movies. You secretly love a girl's school and plan to confess until she uses the men's room. Well, that's... That's unfortunate. That's fine. Okay, so... Reaction. You, have to, you can train your exam taking heart. You, so, if we tick up our IQ by another 700 points, we can we can get a little of that. Okay. Oh, we got. Oh, we have new requests as well. We could ask to go to Europe, a gym membership, or donate to Project Hope. It, it's weird that Project Hope has only a 25% chance of succeeding, but going to Europe has a 75% chance of succeeding. I will try. <laughs> okay. Love those 75% rolls. No fire starting in the long dark was, was uh, that reliable. Anyway. All right, and we have another, we have another New Year event. Where, if we can, if we can master the button clicking, we get free money. You're gonna crash early, Waffle Iron. All right, hey, good, yo, appreciate you coming by, Waffle Iron, and don't, don't worry about the chat. That's why we're here. You know, we're we're here for folks to talk about, you know, whatever. As as long as it's not stuff that sets chat on fire, we're fine. Glad to have you come by, and uh, you know, we'll, uh, you know, we're here at least four days a week, sometimes even five. Yeah, have a good one. Okay, so come back to Aunt Jiling. She loves you the most. Okay, so if we can keep this little this little indicator here in the orange bar, when the timer runs out, we get to keep the money. So we we can't just automatically agree to accept the money. That would be gauche. But at the same time, we can't we can't just aggressively say no. Because then it makes our relatives look bad. So we have we have to reject, but not too hard, and accept, but not too hard. But as you can see, if we can actually manage it, it's good money. Come on, Aunt G okay, we just did Aunt Jiling. Do we have two Aunt Jilings? And this wouldn't be so difficult, save for the fact that the uh, the little indicator there has a life of its own. And just absolutely, you know, just it dances about at the worst possible times. Fortunately, we got the double there, so we're actually up quite a bit. All right, we have. Looking at this, we have eight turns to go, and we have three techs in each of those, and four in our, our chosen profession.
So I think we might just have to uh, pivot and focus on one particular thing. But before we do, let's go to the disco so we can de-stress. And you know what? We have we have the money. We'll buy some books too. There you go, young adult novels. Those are always stressful and in no way post-apocalyptic. There we go. Yeah, right now what we're mostly on the hunt for is knowledge. You know, stat bonuses, particularly in imagination and memory, would be good too, but... Yeah, mostly the knowledge and the free energy are what we're after. Yeah, yeah, we'll do that. And I don't mind... We'll still keep pushing for, like, to find the, the exits to the next level, because they do... Yeah, we managed to push the stat bonus up to 318%. Now, it's only on the... Uh, it's only on these on the knowledge fragments, but or on the uh the stat fragments rather. But still, it's not bad. And there's no need for us to work, obviously, because we just got a huge inf influx of money. there. Yeah, we'll just go ahead and buy that. We're going to be paying full freight here for a while, but you know, it's it's better than continuing to be stuck and then just waiting for, for prices to come down, which they're not going to do that much over the course of just eight turns. Okay, so this will actually get us a fair bit of imagination and memory, and a little bit of EQ, which is super duper nice. Uh, oh yeah, we just did Europe trip. Okay. Well, Europe travel is going to crater our satisfaction, but boy, look at those stat bonuses. You know what? We're going to Europe. During a student dinner, you drink soft beverages with the girls instead of beer like the guys. Excuse me, aren't we at high school? Why are we drinking beer, period? And also, there's nothing wrong with drinking soda, regardless. You don't have to drink alcohol just to be cool, kids. Oh, and we're, we are now king of tablets, too. You like listening to music while studying. Your friend says he studies while voice chatting. Um... How? I, if that's true, I'm. If he studies well, I'm actually kind of impressed. <sighs> yeah. 
You are now sophomores. You've nearly finished all of your courses and will spend your time reviewing what you've learnt. Concentrate on your studies and don't let your 12 years of effort be for nothing. Okay. Well, first things first, obviously we need to go to the shop because there are issues. That lets you max that out. We don't want that. Okay, let's see. We have we have an event. Okay, Sensei Hiyazaki, we're we're living in the digital age. Why are you persisting in drawing by hand? Isn't it really inconvenient? The say that I'm crazily stubborn due to my persistence and inclination toward the traditional. Oh shit! I didn't need to click there. Truly really are a passionate craftsman. Ah, these actually mostly empty words. I personally really dislike computers and all these fancy new gimmicks like CG. But progress will come at one point or another, and all that to me will be discounted by the passing of time. To be honest, it is not important whether you drop by hand or use a dropping tablet. What matters is that you retain your curiosity and stay true to the essence of drawing. Yes, I understand. My studio is using some CG technology, but not a fan. I can share some experience with you if you wish to learn. I want to learn! Seeing as leading new young blood like yourself into the industry is the only way for it to live on, I can only do my best for you. Thank you. Different people focus differently, sure. You often listen to Slaughtercore when you do your coursework. Well, if it works for you, then there you are. Let me check out these traits real quick. Uh, let's see, we got King of Tablets, an epic, very nice. And Europe Tour Guard is just a uh, just a rare. Okay, important. Who doesn't want to be the richest person in the world? But only by buying the first Mega Bank can we truly move beyond toward this goal. Long eventually became the richest man in the world. So there is a voice in your head asking you what type of person you want to become. All right, so now this is where we actually lock in what we're going for, for our future career. We could be an average Joe. We could go for a white collar job. We could try to be a literary giant, uh, a commercial manga artist, a doujin manga artist, or a 2D anime artist. Uh, and this all depends, like what one the the skills you the uh, the extracurricular skills or the or the or the uh, educational skills you've picked, as well as. Uh, and as well, as well uh, the level of stats you get that you, that you finish the game with will determine, like, uh, what tier within this job you have. So, like, so say if you choose, if you, uh, let's say you choose a music route, but your stats are kind of meh, you know, you'll end up like, you'll be a, like a music teacher. Versus, like, if you get all your stats above, like, you know, 12,000 or so, you'll be, like, uh, the... A massive pop star or, or some such thing there are uh, there are guides online if you really want to like, get the exact specific amounts but uh, for this we uh, you know doing doing dojin would be good for the love but we also would like the money so we're going to be a commercial manga artist your current dream is to become a commercial manga artist yep that's uh, close enough Okay. Uh, so we do. We have another election. Uh, but before we do that, we'll go through the prime, the mind map. And see, absorbing talent fragments, the ones with the little, little faces in the middle. They are guaranteed to grant an extra, extra bit of knowledge. So those would be very helpful. So it's, it's like, it's like two nodes for the price of one. Because yeah, looking at one of those counts or takes uh, 15 action points, and but then like clicking on the like on one of those gets you 25 knowledge for 10. So that is like that's you're getting 
a little bit less knowledge, but also a, a plus one to your uh, per turn stat for 15 action points, which is a, a great deal, really. Okay, do we have any energy? We do not. Okay, let's just roll on then. Okay. Yeah, this map has been considerably less kind to us, so... Oh, well. Alright, let's go... <laughs> okay, so... This election isn't as rigged as a previous one. The previous two, the, the kid in the middle, already had, like, a... Uh, a 15-point lead in the standings. Now it's only 10. So, let's take away. For the class president's election, I implore you to make your own judgments. Yeah, just like you did the previous times. All right. Well, this is different. This is a different again. Because the last two times, the character over here has opened by attacking me. But instead, he's going to suck up to the teacher. All right. So let's, we're going to do our usual, uh, our usual approach of just promoting ourselves. So they got us 5%. So it's, uh, okay, there we go. Now we're back to the usual. Wait. He allied with me, but only he got a buff. Well, that's rude. All right. Wait, my dude, you just attacked me the previous turn. Now you're now you're saying we're buds? What's going on here? And now the turn after you ally with me, you attack me. What is happening? Is this the House of Representatives? This makes no sense. We're just we're, just, <laughs> we're gonna keep doing our thing. Now, now, okay, now, now we're in the lead. Now we'll see if they really come after us. Yep, here we go. You know, hey, we're, we're, uh, our relationship with the teacher is not basically non-existent. We're not very likable, but. Damn, are we moral? And apparently that's what counts. Alright, not gonna do anything stupid. There we go. Woohoo! Finally, we win an election. So we get 820 knowledge. Wow! Okay. So it actually is worth working the crowd. Interesting that it's a buff to it's a buff to knowledge, but no face. But oh, that's it's fine. It's it's free knowledge points, and you know that is, and that that's that's what we are we are uh, thirsting for at this point. We have seven turns to go. Yeah, we're going. Okay, so now this has EQ, imagination, and memory. So I guess it's good that those are our three best stats, even though EQ is kind of lagging behind. But you know, no, we we have cast our lot. We're going all in. And whatever happens, happens. We have, we have, we have chosen our life's profession before we're even done with high school. Uh, a decision 
that I'm sure cannot possibly go wrong. Uh, but yeah, maybe we'll stay away from Europe travel, because, uh... Yeah, it, does, it, uh, it didn't go very well for us when we did that. You too was safe away from Europe. Yeah, you know, it's... it's... I mean, according to the game, it's supposed to flex the fact that we are a, we are a middle-class family, but... Uh, um, but it's probably not anything we want to do on the regular. No, it's fine. It's yeah, you are not obliged to go to Europe if you don't choose to, Satan. Okay, you suspect the natural talent is important. Dad says you just don't work hard enough because yeah, pile yeah, pile more stress on us. It oh, yikes! That looks only a little bit frightening. Gao Cow is nearing, and you don't seem to have appetite and can't catch a good night's rest. Really? I wonder why ever that might be. So, Mom makes you chicken soup. What you really need is sleep. Alright, well. And we have another show. Do we have any good traits we haven't tried out yet? We did Piano Beast. Album Lover, Wave Breaker, and Pinion Spelling Bee, so... I don't know, we'll try King of Tablets. I guess if they're supposed to be the most peculiar, maybe... I don't know, let's... Let's see. Uncle... Yeah, yeah good old Uncle Carl. Let's go win again. No, and then... Woohoo! Everything's coming up. Snedemwick. 250 knowledge and 100 face. Wow. We got four figures worth of face. That seems like a lot. Okay, we have another... Oh, I was like, we have another with, uh... Mayao Hiyazaki. Who are you? Are you doing 3D models? Yes, but I'm pretty bad at it. Uh, I'm not very good at it myself, after all. I've spent my, all my life drawing by hand. I can, however, show you a few tips and tricks. Really? Thank you. But don't forget the anime basics course I taught you about before. It contains the core of anime. Without a solid foundation, all peripheral knowledge is meaningless. Yes, I still remember your wise words. I'll continue to practice the basics as well. Ah, I see you have some talent. Okay, we'll check in with our friendly shopkeep here. What have we got? Oh. Well, we're going to de-stress, and de-stress, and what do we have here? We have mind supplements, which are apparently an entertainment. We have a high-level home tutor. Or we have five years of Galkao. Doing real exam questions is the best entertainment you can get your hands on during your final year. Oof. Okay, game. You sold me. Eat the shopkeeper. He, I don't know. He, as long as the home tutor isn't a hitman. Well, it's I know I know that the shopkeep doesn't look like he leads that healthy of a lifestyle. I don't know. That would seem to be a net negative. So maybe we don't.
Oh, wait, okay, so... Oh, so... Observing Imagination Fragments gives us an extra five knowledge, okay. Nice enough, not a, not a huge buff, but... Not terrible, either. Yeah, I would think having a Titman as a home tutor would be... That, that wouldn't be a... Uh... Well, I guess it depends on what the Hitman's tutoring us on is. I mean... Yeah, it depends on what the subject matter is. I mean, if it's the Gaokao, probably not. But I mean, unless, unless said Hitman, say, did well on the Gaokao and then went to a prestigious university, in which case... They'd probably be a, very, a, a home tutor in high demand. Well, shucks. They're shut out early here. And no free energy either. But at least we get decent value out of that. And we'll take that so we can just we can uh, finish up the uh, IQ request next turn. Oh, there's an anime about a home tutor who is a hitman and a baby. Wait, the the are they a home tutor, a hitman, and baby all in one, or a home tutor who is a hitman as well as, and there is also a character who is a baby. I think I think the latter is what you're going for. I think. Oh, he is both a hitman and a baby. A magic baby. Okay. I I, I would assume so if they have if they have those kind of skills. Yeah. Let's just see. Oh, we have five years of Gao Cao. Okay, so that we, we get satisfaction from the parents. It stresses us out a little bit. But man, look at those stat gains. Ooh-wee. I mean, with those kind of returns, we can't we can't afford not to buy the five years of Gao Cao. Although, honestly, we get a hundred for all of those. These, we get five stress, we get, we, we get... Yeah. So we get hundreds across the board, plus action. We get satisfaction. And actually, less stress. The only difference is, like, the charm and the face. But we're not really using either of those. You know what? Let's just do... So we'll gain some stress so we can buy that down. We get a lot of satisfaction. And we'll just get a silly amount of, of stat points across the board. I don't see why we wouldn't. Oh, the kid is the kid he is tutoring is in a is a random Japanese school kid, who it turns out is next in line to head an Italian mafia family. Wait, he's now he, is he a school kid in Japan who is Italian, or is like Italian and Japanese? Because I know the, the mafia they they're kind of particular about their bloodlines. If I if I remember Mario Puzo's work correctly. Especially the bit with the the, the bit with uh, Luca Brasi. Okay. Your study level tests have all been done, so everyone takes the final exam just for show. Okay, that's fine. And again, some amount of stress is motivating. Oh, he has an Italian great-something father who was the first head of the family. Ah, I see. Some students take Gaokao and other provinces to get the upper hand, but they usually get found out. It's interesting that that, that, that knowledge de-stresses us. 
but also you know, dings are a charm. But yeah, I can see that, you know, you want to... If universities have quotas to take students from X film from you know, less populated provinces, yeah, I can I can definitely see some people trying to sneak across the border, you know, make it look like they're in in Heilongjiang instead of instead of like Beijing or Tianjin. You've been working hard recently. Spare no effort and you'll make it into a key university. Okay, well we have, a, we got another choice, let's see. Some of your classmates' parents are worth millions, yet your father earns but a few thousand a month and just slouches on the couch all day. You tell him, Dad, I think you should work harder. Dad, why aren't you and Mom rich? Or, Dad, all my classmates have so much money. This feels like they could all go very, very wrong. Um, but let's ask an open-ended question, a how or a why question, and then we'll leave room to answer. So, Dad, why aren't you and Mom rich? I'd like to ask your grandparents this question. Okay, hey, it gets us a buttload of imagination, and that's good for us. We do our we do our disco dancing to relax, as, as the youth are wont to do. You just got one more to go there. Oh right, and we have the event. Yeah, you've learned the basics well. It's time to see the fruits of your labor. Ah, oh, but I have prepared. If you wait before you are prepared to tackle the world, then you will miss all the chances laid out before you. Perhaps you'll do better than you think. Uh, okay, I'll, I'll try my best. Okay, so prepare a short story and tell it using a 3 to 5 minute animation. Just draw it however you like, be it be 2D, 3D, by hand, or by tablet. Making my own anime, that sounds so dreadfully difficult. Don't worry about that, I've seen the progress you've made! The reason we're having this short test is because I feel you have what it takes. Besides, after you've done, you'll be able to see how much you've progressed yourself, and that'll motivate you to study even harder. Isn't that that so? I understand, I will give it my all. Okay, yeah, so that is actually the last bit in our... Uh, our anime skill tree. Then we can go back to actually doing regular school stuff. Real quick, I just... Why not? Let's see what Phoebe's up to. Okay, Phoebe is not the athletic type. I don't think she's into anime. Okay. Though, again, that that's part of the that's part of the frustration. Is that sometimes, like in the RNG, there's there are no good options. Annoying, but that is that's the way the game is set up. And yeah, and yeah, that is, um, and I would say, like, if you're playing a female character, um, basically the roles are reversed. I mean, there's still, like, the three dialogue boxes, but basically the boys, you choose a boy to, to hang out with, you still pay the, the energy cost, but then, like, the boys come to you, and all you, it is, uh, it's, it's uh, far easier, because, like, you, you can pick, uh, you will have the option, like, to pick, uh, characters to hang out with after school and you can pick male or female characters but you basically just uh you can 
build a relationship with them turn by turn just by hanging out with them. You don't have to do this every single turn thing. Now obviously, in real life, dating while female has its own unique challenges. So we're not we're not making any we're not making uh, any uh, any correlations between in-game experience and real life. But I was it is you know, the difficulty uh, of dating while playing a male character is one of the more annoying aspects of the game. But again, it's you know it feels like you know lackluster design, but it's it's not game breaking, especially when you consider like you know within like the world of. A, a young Chinese person in school they are they receive a lot of pressure to basically ignore romantic relations at the ver you know at least until they're done with high school so I guess in that sense it is it is uh, true to true to the uh, what happens in real life even though it's <laughs> Even like, though know, uh, you know, other parts of the game are actually it all are also like not exact, not hinging on realism. Like I don't know, talking our way into an internship with a, a, my Mayao Hiyazaki, I guess we're calling him. Okay, real quick, we'll go ahead and grab that. We actually get 50 action out of that, so that's, that's a good boost. But, seems like... Yep, yeah, okay, we're not progressing here. So I had to swat a bug there real quick. Um, so yeah, we'll take... Yeah, we'll take those. Do we go for money, or do we take another crack at Phoebe? No, no. Eyes on the prize. Focus on those. We'll do... Oh, no, we need 20. All right. Well, we can always do that. We can make the, make the hand, paper, silhouettes. The money won't be nearly as good, but at least we'll get some value out of the... Uh, out of that energy. There you go, all 29. Okay. We have, uh... There you go, we have done the entire skill tree there. We'll have a look, but uh, yeah, I just say we hammer on this one more time. Oh, an earthquake drill takes place in the city, and the alarm sounds, but no one leaves the classroom. Yeah, that that sounds about right. Okay, your cousin has a child, and you suddenly turn into an uncle or aunt. It feels odd. Yeah, yeah, I can, I can, I can see that. Okay, you get on well with your grandparents and always enjoy going out to the countryside. Yeah, absolutely. Okay, now we have a. I think we have our last event with Mayao Hiyazaki. What, uh, what do you think? Not bad! It's pretty good! Both in terms of finesse and animation, and how much you have portrayed this story. 
I knew you were capable of doing a short anime such as this, but the results far exceed my expectations. Are you serious? How many points would you give my anime? Hmm, well, I'll give it 9 out of 10. One point short, what makes it a 9 instead of a 10? <laughs> I wasn't wrong about you, but of course, I should tell you that one of the reasons for this little test was to find out your shortcomings. This one point has to do with the most important lesson which I am about to teach you. The way in which you tell a story that is your story bold. The story is good, but the way in which it was told cannot be improved upon. It was too plain and straightforward. If your story just follows a single line throughout, the audience will find themselves getting distracted and bored. That is why it needs some ups and downs. That is one of the most difficult parts to get right in anime, and to master it requires time and practice. Okay, I understand now. Thank you so much. I'll work hard and improve myself. Okay. So this right here is why we've been uh, stockpiling all these requests over the course of the game. Now, an apartment near school, very nice. Don't have to commute, lack of commute is good. Practice tests, also very helpful, but what we want is this thing, the Huang Gong, Huang Gong exam book. Yeah, the exam for this, you know, yes, yeah, so this, it's basically the closest you get to actually being able to practice for the Gao Cao. It only has a 25% roll, so that is why we keep these. Just in case. <laughs> so, of course, we nail it on the first try. Woohoo! So, uh, yeah. Okay. Um, we got four turns left? Yeah, we got four turns left here. So I guess now, I suppose, we can turn our attention back to actual academics, you know. But not that we need them where we're going. We're going straight to the top of the anime world. And we have one last... We have one last set of... Uh, a mid, uh, a, mid, a midterm exam, basically, so we can hoover up more knowledge points. Uh, knife techniques in case you want to become the Hitman home tutor. Um, well, bear that in mind, Sid. We, we, we will probably... I don't want to say for sure, but there's a good chance we'll have you know some small amounts of uh, knowledge points left over. Then we can jump into those. Okay, um, these are all asking for red. We do not have red. Of course. You know what? Let's just re-roll. And it asks for more red. Okay, yeah, we're... I am not pleased by this. Okay, there we go. Those were the same. There we go. That was a nice, juicy one. Alright, and yeah, now, now all of a sudden we're all purple. 
as you do. Yeah, think we might be kind of hosed here. All right, so we didn't get much out of that, but fortunately we can we can grab a couple. I'll go and grab those other ones too because they're they're basically as cheap as they're maybe they've been as cheap as they're going to get for quite some time, but you know. Oh well. So now, we clear the floor again, and we did get that, and that, but what we're after, we had the Hong Gong group. The Hong, the Hong Gong exam book is basically the, uh, the five years of Gao Cao, but like, supercharged. A little bit more stress, a lot more satisfaction, and triple the stat gains. So, you know, if you're, if you're late in the game, and you want, and you, there's a there's a stat level you want to hit. Save up your requests, get the Huang Gong, and then just hammer it. You're gonna gain stress, but that's okay, because you only have four turns to go. So unless you're coming in with your 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 mind shadow particularly high, you just tank it and move on. Because you can see, for one turn we're getting 1,800. In each in each uh, stat level. Yeah, Huang Gong, a famous Chinese school. You read their exam book, and then it is the thing that's supposed to set you up for the for success on the on the Gao Cao. Oh, yeah. And those who, who do not wish to attend university have joined society and begun working. <laughs> I don't know why we're getting stressed out of that, but okay. You are high school seniors now. The importance of this year is greater than you may realize. You'll have to fight tooth and nail if you want to come out on top. What university you enter dictates your whole future life. Now, obviously, in the real world, that is complete bullshit. But... In the universe of this game, it actually does carry a little salience. Okay, yeah, we saw 8 out of 10, 7 out of 10, 8 out of 10. We definitely need math this round. And what do we have? Okay, we have another choice. So you get too little sleep while preparing for the exam, and you're off and unfocused. Your mom buys you three kind of supplements, and you decide to take Oral Blue, American Ginseng, or Thick Chicken Broth. Ugh, thick broth? I don't know. And I have no idea what Oral Blue is. It sounds like mouthwash. Maybe we'll try the American Ginseng. After drinking it, your nose starts bleeding profusely. Oh, wait. You... Okay, maybe not. Oh well. Tomato soup is spaghetti. Well, it's or is or is spaghetti sauce coagulated tomato soup? You know, is it is it a chicken and the egg kind of thing? All right, so that obviously did not have the intended effect. <laughs> anyway. Yeah, honestly, at this point. Nothing is getting cheaper. We're all, we're just, oh yeah, oh and ignore, igno absorbing knowledge fragments gives us an extra five knowledge. Yeah, so we're we're all about the knowledge here, cause I don't know that we're gonna be yeah. And then buying down or uh, uh, picking fragments isn't gonna be that useful. 
with only a few turns to go. And we're also getting like 1800 points per turn when we go all in on the Huang Gong. Okay, and then we run into a situation like this. So we are kind of stuck. So what do we do? Well, it, we would, it would make sense to, to waste what we have. So we'll make... So we have... We have blue but we're probably fine we have purple but i think we're we're already through the imagination part of the of the, of the, the imagination requiring part of the skill tree so no worries there yeah i think we just take the yellow and we roll the dice you know one more outing with phoebe discuss life what's all this red goo or dear dot dot dot. What's all this red goo? Yeah. That went about the way I expected. Okay, well, we definitely need to do the math. Yeah, so now we're 8 out of 10, 8 out of 10, 8 out of 10. Yeah, I think we'll save the rest of our points. Maybe we'll try to we'll try to roll more more knowledge in the future. For now, More Hong Kong. Okay, I think I think I know what's happening now. So when either so when the satisfaction ticks over positively, we get one of these, you know, parental approval ones. And that's if it goes down beneath below, you get the other way. And then I'm not sure if stress can go all the way down, but if it, if stress goes over, then yeah, we, then we get a negative affliction. So, so maybe these events aren't completely random. <laughs> you finished all the senior high school courses ahead of time. Now it's only revision left. Okay, so. Yeah, that, sounds, that looks about accurate. Excuse me. We game creators work really hard, so don't argue. Just play the game. Hey. We're not arguing. We're we are engaging in reasoned critical analysis. But thank you for the charm buff. Okay. Dad says that getting used to stress will make your heart bigger. Yeah, and that's not a good thing. You know, an, an enlarged heart is a medical condition, not not something to be desired. All right, so we still have the knowledge fragment bit. Let's pop the shop real quick, because we are... Okay, see, have an appropriate amount of stress for extra bonuses. I don't know what an, an appropriate amount of stress is, but... It still feels like we are way, in a, we are way beyond it. Yep, just gonna hoover up all the knowledge we can. And then keep on a moving. Because at this point, there's not much sense in doing anything else.
Uh, okay, no, well, we can't do that. We don't need money anymore, so what the heck. Okay, we are to, you know, we got, and we need to spend that, well, we don't need to. We'll go ahead and spend those last few XP just to get a little bit more money. But yeah, we're, we're just we're just about there. We are at uh, at two turns to go. We got an extra got an extra twelve quai for getting the getting those uh, groceries for our parents. So we can afford the English, which puts us nine out of ten. So not bad. And we're stuck at eight out of ten on Chinese and math. So now we're gonna we're gonna take the that one final assessment, and then it's gonna tell us we're behind the curve, obviously. Yep. English, we should be fine. Okay, we're we're not exactly fine, but we're pretty close. And science and arts, we're right there. If you keep this up, you won't make it into university. If you don't go to uni, how are you expecting to marry someone? Ugh. Yeah, so, you know, science and arts were fine, so we can leave those. Um, I would say the rest we need to buy more of, but we don't. <laughs> we don't have we don't have the points, and everything's just too damn expensive. But at this point, you know, there's there's no sense in doing anything else. We're gonna Huang Gong this thing till the cows come home. Self, -a so we are now self-abased. You doubt that drinking coffee helps your studies, but it sure makes it harder to sleep at night. Yep, yep, just just pile on all the stress. All the stress. <laughs> the silhouette you've been gazing at disappears and is replaced by various school notes. Okay, that sounds healthy. I know you're all very tired, but a senior year without pain is a year without gain. Your family will be happy when they see the fruits of your hard labor. Okay, so our mind shadow is is still fine. So e even if we take over stress again, we should be okay. I don't know what self-abased is doing for us, but yeah, whatever. More, yeah, we're gonna disco the stress away as much as we can. So we're going to need about 14, at least like 1400 knowledge if you want to get the the next to last tier, the exam oriented Chinese and, and math. Are we going to get that? Eh, it'll be tight. But we can certainly shoot for the moon and and try to get there, because yeah, we, we have already yeah we have, we already we have achieved what we set out to achieve, become like the a high level mangaka, despite still being in high school. Everything else, academic success, parental approval, that's all gravy. Alright, come on, come on. 
Let's not get sidetracked. Oh yeah, now we have now we have the enthusiastic. So we we want to we want to be shooting for imagination fragments as well. Ah, ah. So close. Get to 1367, so not quite the 1400 we need, but darn close. We'll definitely buy the the uh, the Chinese because that's the cheapest. So at the very if we have if we have another mind map next turn, we'll be able to get the math, and that'll. That should get us... Remind yourself that overconfidence is a slow and insidious killer. Thank you, Satan, but... Uh... <laughs> we would only need to find four knowledge points, or yeah, knowledge uh, nodes in the map, so I think we'll be okay. I think. Not Hondo P, not, not a guarantee, but I feel pretty certain. Oh, you wanted to know what that was. Well, there you go. Yeah. Um, I just, it, I just, I threw a couple of darkest dungeons in there as well. Okay. Is it? Yeah, this is one last round of Huang Gong. <laughs> to save time, you tell mom to only cook food that is quick to eat. No more bony fish. I guess that makes sense. Oh, studying all day is led to a mental breakdown. Your head hurts as your memory declines. Well, gee, thanks for all that. You don't like eating Yeah, I don't either. I think one time I tried. Uh, I what was it? I, I bought a fillet of sole at the at the market, not knowing what it was, and then I tucked in, and boy, was that a surprise! That fish is like almost all bone. Okay, no, we don't. We do not, in fact, get a uh, get a mind map. Instead, we have one of these. That's fine. We that actually should be easier. Oh, the the cost of the advanced math has gone down. Yeah. It w well, we're getting eighteen hundred points per turn, so I would I, I would hope that the cost would go down. Because we're yeah we are we're at nine 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 eight and nine actually yeah so math is actually a turn behind, which is probably part of the reason it gets down as cheap as it is. So we're definitely getting that. Anything else we can squeeze out of it will be a bonus. But yeah, see the the big red gal cow button there. We're not. Uh... <laughs> yeah, we are at the end game. So now we're just gonna try to rack up as mi as much knowledge as we can in the little match three game, which hasn't been very kind to us of late. But yeah, you know, we're gonna power through regardless. There we go. Oh, gee. Thanks for all that. Yep, just reroll. Just reroll. There we go. We'll get some of that nonsense out of there. Lovely.
Excellent. Okay, where are we? There we are. Okay, we want a purple two. There's our purple two. Now we need we need basically all the gold we can manage. Which doesn't look like it's gonna be a lot. Good grief. Okay. Uh, let's see. All right, we got some more purple coming down the pipe. That's good. Okay. I see how it is. All right, so let's... Okay, we'll go heavy on the gold then, I get apparently. All right, we have a purple two. We can go for a second purple two, or we can go for a gold two. Which are we more likely to get? We're more likely to get the purple. enough gold to do anything. Okay, yeah, we're pretty well hosed here, but that's... It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Everything's fine. Okay. We have 1,355, which is not enough to do the math, which we need to do. And either of the other to tick us over into 10 out of 10. So we're going to be nines across the board there. We'll grab those. And so now we just have $500 just sitting around. So you know what? We're going to learn how to exercise. How to be quiet. Something you learn as a high school senior. And just for Satan, we're going to learn some knife technique. And how to esports, and how to computer, and how to paint, and how to basketball. Oh, reinstall operating systems. Is it said reinstalling operating systems is lucrative? Apparently, not as lucrative as being a manga assistant, though. Okay, so that's it. We've spent everything we can. Knife technique? Yes, knife crazy. Welcome back. A technique named just for you. Now we go to the gal cow. Yeah, we, and we have just... We've crested 20,000 imagination. Now here's the thing. Yeah, so for, fortunately, I think fortunately, we don't... We ourselves do not actually take the Gal Cow. Basically, however we have coached up our our progeny, that that's how they're gonna do. So basically, we just sit back and wait for the results, almost like we were the parents. 
So many winters, many winters have passed. It was in the middle of the June I accepted the first great challenge of my life. So as I had to wade through a sea of countless parents. I guess my my whole being went tranquil after finishing the last subject. Is my high school life over? Yes, it was over before we even had time to bid it farewell. I felt a sense of relief. However, the ensuing summer was filled with anxiety about the future, at least until that fateful day when the admission letter lay quietly waiting for me on the table. So, what was school? Did Snadamwick get in? I'm going to go out on a limb and say probably not PKU or Tsinghua, because we we didn't get to 10 out of 10 on any of the uh, any of the big subjects, but I don't know. Let's see. We got into Hunan Normal University. A score of five five five. So Hunan Normal University, I guess not great, not terrible. You know, it, it's not it's not anywhere out in the far west. And but, but but neither is it like anywhere sexy in Beijing or Shanghai. So eh, you know. But that's fine. We weren't focusing on academics, we were focusing on preparing for our career. And we got a little a little uh a little reminisce a little reminiscence thing here. Yep, so we uh we did we won one of the episodes of Ch of China's Got Trait. And at, at the at the last moment, we managed to squeeze our way into being class president, and we learned a special trait. So we, yeah, we got a legendary skill. I think it was a uh, oh, it was yeah, a uh, piano beast. So you worked your long life to the bone and got into an average middle school. Yeah, but just just think how bad things would have been if we didn't work ourselves to the bone knife. Okay, the parents didn't have any actual requirements. They just want me to be happy. So we filled nine expectations. I worked hard as a child. My parents often used to flaunt. They used me to flaunt. That was called others' as child. Well, yeah, no kidding. When we're young, we follow our dreams, worrying too much. Everyone's path is different. One after another, we begin our careers. Okay, and these were, I guess, our friends. Somehow we were friends with Voltaire, Giant Yao, and Ninji, who just never appear at all. I guess I, I take that back. I think Giant Yao makes an appearance if you if you take the basketball playing route. But other than that, no, they're just a they're just a a, a figure in the distance. So now, okay, now that university life is coming to an end, I, as well as most others, have set out to find work. In the end, I became a legendary manga artist. Yeah, we did it, Reddit. Some say I'm a legend in the realm of manga. I think they might be over praising me. I am proud of my work, but I've mostly done serials for commercial manga magazines. Hey! That's steady work. Before you know it, you have a steady job, but your parents start fretting about your marriage. I knew that my parents would urge me to marry, but they recommended a few suitable partners, and I just gave it a go. Okay. So here's the thing. You can't, you cannot stay single. You have to marry and have a kid because that perpetuates the generations. So these two are basically just NPCs generated by the game. Or we also, we made an attempt to date Phoebe, um, but are we, we had one success to start and then we did nothing but fail with her in every other attempt, so we have a 1% roll to succeed with Phoebe. But we're going to try it anyway, because if you fail with your your uh, your attempted date, uh, the game will give you a pity spouse. And they'll look exactly like your mother and father, which is, is all kinds of creepy. So here we go. We're going to we're going to Go for that 1% crit, and we're going to date Phoebe. I'm sure everything will be fine. She rejected us. Oh, uh, who could possibly have seen this coming? 
In the end, you can but compromise. Instead of finding your love, you must marry a stranger you've never met. <laughs> oh no. The day has finally come. A new life is born. I finally have become a parent myself. You there. Yes, you. The one in front of the screen. Will you, Chief Mike, will you keep my child company? Yeah. And here's the thing. Um, as you play through the generations, your family level increases. And then it unlocks uh, other potential professions, other NPCs. Um, and I, I have a... Uh, I, I, I already had 60, 60 hours in this beforehand, so yeah, we pretty much unlocked everything. But now, you can pick the way, the kind, of, the kind of parenting you want to set up. So, strict upbringing, whatever, or full obedience. Yeah, whatever. Okay, expectations for the future, family glory, average Joe, or happy life. Whatever. Your attitude is toward exam requirements, ex focus on exams, Balance or interest first? Yeah, I'll go for balance. I'll get your degree of doting. So we're going to be considerate, moderate, or we're going to be, uh, we're going to be, we're going to give you, we're going to give the kids space. Your attitude toward personal guidance, you know, do your part, moderation, or maverick. Um, yeah, I'm less clear about this. So, moderation in all things, including moderation. Okay, so they have a, 10 a plus 10% chance to acquire the traits when they're learning skills. So, yeah, and as you can see, the pity spouse you end up with looks exactly like the, the uh, starter mom. So, yeah, so negligent raising. Our parents didn't educate us much, and we grew up all right. We believe in freedom. You'll grow up all right. Sure, that's us. Okay, here we go. All right. I'm gonna pop back to the title screen here real quick. So yeah, folks, that is Chinese parents. I think it's a pretty neat game. Um, obviously, there's a lot. Of, there's yeah, it's lots of Chinese culture in there, lots of Chinese memes. I don't necessarily <laughs> claim to understand each and every one of them, but you can definitely get the gist, and you can, you can definitely tell the heavy pressure kids are under. You know, they're, they're, not, they're not really supposed to work, they're not supposed to date, it's all supposed to be about academics and, all the, and the extremely competitive environment in which they find themselves. But I, you know, I, I've had fun playing it. Uh, I, you can definitely see the carryover between this and growing up. Although they, they each had like their they had their distinct elements as well. Not just the setting, but like this one, uh, the Chinese parents has it has the uh, you know the generational system. Whereas you know in growing in growing up, each new generation is basically a blank slate. Basically, they, the uh, growing up looks much slicker. The music is great. Um, it does have you know LGBT representation, you know, which is remarkable for a game ostensibly set in the '90s. But yeah, I strongly recommend both, and that is that is the uh, the first entry in our Lunar New Year showcase. But that's not going to be it for today. No, no. I have another one lined up. So real quick. Uh, we're going to cut this here for the YouTube crowd. Uh, we're going to flip to the BRB screen real quick, and I'm going to fire up the next game. So just be with me. You know, bear with me. We'll be back in just a moment. <laughs> 